get out of- Oh, I just killed that person. Sorry, buddy. Sorry. Oh, God. Okay, this is a progress race. Noted, so I don't have to, uh, worry about laps here. Which I kind of like laps, because it gives me a chance to actually learn the track. Like, by the end of the race, I'll at least know of a turn or something like that. Unlike these races, where I have no freaking clue what I'm doing. Damn, how is she so far ahead? That's bullshit. That is bullshit. You are racing against R35 and R34 Skylines here. And you're pulling away in your 370. You must have that thing souped to the max. Because I got this thing souped to the max. And I'm not catching you. Okay, now I'm definitely catching. Oh shit, that was some that was some air right there. Throw your co coming in hot. Well, that was one way to overtake her, I suppose. I suppose that works. Okay, car understeer. What the hell, GTR? You're supposed to be a handling machine. What are you doing? Not turning on a dime. What are you doing? Uh, okay. Kept it in line there. Everything was nice and... Okay, we're gonna lose it here. Or we lost it a little bit there. Slid. Slid a little bit. Broke the traction. Okay, keep her in check. Good. 70% of the race done. Only a wee bit more to go. No, 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 no. That's a bad turn. That's a bad turn. Okay, I'm... Re uh, no, I'm not losing because of that damn turn. Screw that. We gotta slow down more. Oh god, okay, I still didn't quite do it justice. Oh god. I lost some serious time with that turn. Okay, we gotta not do that again. Can't afford that. Man, I love I love tunnel noises. They're glorious. They're glorious things they are. Oh god, she's gaining on me. She is she is right behind me. She's like a freaking shark. Just constantly Behind me, waiting to pounce or strike, I guess. Sharks don't really pounce, they're in water. I don't think you can pounce on water. Unless it's like shallow water. Then I guess you can pounce around in the in the kiddie pool. Okay, first place, take that, Haley. You'll suck. Yeah, I'm whipping ass at this level. Soon to take over Darius Flint. Only 1,000 points to go. What is that, like five more races? About five, probably six, because I'll probably lose. Um, nah, let's let's remain in the McLaren. I'm having fun driving it around. It's a fun car. Just to uh, just to watch the spoiler go up and down is pretty fun. So, what can I say? I'm a I'm a child at heart. I'm, I'm a child of real life. So whatever. Screw you. I'm going home. Got a Vici playing on the radio. Okay. Turn around. Okay, road trip continues. Whoa. I need to paint my wheels black. They look better black. Just my opinion. Come on, Ray. What you got? What you got, Ray? Street race. Oh, what the hell are you driving? Okay, there's no way in hell you are competing with me, buddy. Ugh. I get a good feeling. And almost to the interstate, and then the fun part begins. And we get to go really fast. I enjoy going fast. I want to go fast. Watch out, dude. You're being a real asshole, you know that? Breaking and stuff, how dare you follow street laws? Can't you see I don't care? Oh, man. I enjoy the interstate. Ugh. Bishop, so long, sucker. What was he driving in? Pretza? Subi? WRX? Dang, dude. This thing's fast for being completely stock. At least I'm pretty sure this is stock, right? I didn't upgrade it. I don't remember upgrading it. If I did... I don't think I did. Pretty sure it's stock. Oh, am I gonna break 200? Come on! Big 200! We can do it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Only two to go. One down! Oh! Aw, oh, man, incline. Damn, I was 199. Man, I fucked that guy up. That was bad. Oh, wow, I just got 100,000 in credits? Jeez. What'd I get that for? Oh, shit. 
Oh, come on, that has to be a new record. Oh, my personal best is 204? Holy crap. What was I using then? I was just flying through there. I'm hitting cars left and right right now. I don't even care about your darn traffic. I'm turning left. I am turning left. I just got 100,000 credits for something back there. Speed challenge, though. Apparently, I went fast for a certain period of time or something. I'm not really sure what I needed to do to qualify for that, but I'll take it. I will take your money. Rockfield. Oh, he's got a he's got a McLaren too. It's pretty sweet. Pretty sweet, dude. Oh god, watch out. Almost there. We are all on Frost. Get out the way, Frost. Oh yeah, look at that spoiler, dude. Look at that pure air breakage. That's epic. Let's see. Let's let's find the threshold of this air brake. Okay, it's got to be higher than 60. Um, 70? Got to be higher than 70. I thought it was 60 on the on the Veyron. Maybe it was 60 kilometers. 100. Okay. Okay. Isn't doesn't 60 kilometers translate to 100 miles an hour? I'm pretty sure it does. Could be wrong about that. Maybe it's 60 miles an hour translates to 100 kilometers. I don't know. Fucking metrics in America and our non-metric bullshit. Good news is now all the gots to do is find this here. Oh, what the fucking geyser, man! Wow, that timed perfectly with like that bass drop. I don't know why the hell I'm going back here. Like, like there's gonna be something back there. That was awesome. That geyser went off as soon as the bass on this song dropped, so that's pretty neat. Hmm, if I was a broken down car hidden in an old shitty barn, where would I be? I feel like this is like the starting area. Looks kind of like it. I haven't drove over here yet. Okay. Oh, upgrade sign. Upgrade sign! Don't mind if I do. This does appear to be the starting area, at least it seems familiar. Which I guess it would make sense that they put a barn find in the starting area, and I guess it would make sense that I didn't find it when I was here. Oh, no, I can't go up there. Can't go up there. Whatevs, man. Let's go this way. Let's go this way. I haven't drove this road yet. This is a pretty neat road. If I... Wait, what is this over here? Can't go over there. Okay. Never mind. Let's go this way. Oh, barn find. Where art thou? Ooh, look at that guy and his charger. Oh, what is this? What is this? Upgrade sign. Upgrade sign. I'm questioning if all the barns have to look the same or if they can be different. Okay, apparently it's not here. Apparently it is not there, so... I'm guessing it'd probably be off on a dirt road. And there was a few dirt roads over here, so maybe I'll just do that, I don't know. Where the hell this thing is, watch out you and your Corvette. Oh. Broke that fence. Look at that 25 mile an hour speed limit. Ha! Is it gonna? Is the barn always gonna be in the middle of the circle, or could it be like on the outskirts too? I don't think it's gonna be out here. Yeah, it's not gonna be out here. Let's just forget that altogether. That's not gonna. Nothing's gonna be down that road apparently. Huh? Oh, Mr. Barnfind. Well, I haven't drove this road over here yet, so... Maybe it is over here. Of course, this circle just happens to take place where there's like a bunch of freaking buildings everywhere. Instead of just like on an open plain where you could be able to spot one lonely barn. da 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 da, -da. This is looking promising, but probably not. Um, nope. No, no bar. Oh, what is this? Is this it? Oh my goodness! I found it! Oh, what is that? An NSX? 
My, my, my. Oh, that's Remember a Bugatti. Them? Hey! The things people leave to luck in a barn. That's awesome. This what are the, the odds? Bugatti EB110 Super Sport. Built yeah, I know. One of the most evocative brands the world has seen. Back in the 90s, this was one of the most technically advanced cars that had ever been created. Yeah, and it would be a lot better looking without those silly headlights. Huh, well that's crazy. Um, that's extra crazy actually, because in one of my last videos, one of you guys commented saying like, hey, the, uh, the Bugatti Barn Find is the fastest car in the game, and I was like, oh, so you're telling me I'm not going to be able to have the fastest car in the game then, because I suck at finding barn finds. So what are the odds that I would find that one next? That's weird. That's crazy. It's pretty cool though. I'll have to drive that when it's upgraded or whenever it's uh fixed up. Okay, let's just go to the Oakley Juggernauts here. In 100 yards. There's some races over here to do. Unfortunately, that orange race is only worth 180. But I'll probably still do it just because it's right there and it'll save me time of driving to the next event. Well, that's pretty cool. I'm glad I found that now. I'm glad I took the time to drive all over the place just to find that. I didn't think it would be that, honestly. At first I thought it was an NSX, which I would have been perfectly okay with, because I love the NSX, so... Okay. I don't know why I just rewound. I was... My instincts of racing were kicking in, and I just kind of spammed the rewind button. But I forgot that I'm not racing, so it doesn't matter if I completely screw up and, uh... turn around. It'll just take me a little bit longer. Near miss times 100. Okay, 89th, dude. I broke the broke the top 80. That's pretty neato. In 400 yards, turn right. Okay, preparing to turn right in 400 yards. There's a purple race over here that I'm actually gonna do though. I'm gonna ignore my GPS for now and branch out over here. Since it's just right here, might as well. Shut up, GPS. I don't care. Oh man, I missed it. Oh wait, I was in the vicinity. I totally could have just hit X. There we go. Halfway there, racer boy. Must be Japanese. Oh, okay. I can definitely do that. Let's use the Impreza. Oh man. Never mind. What class does I have to leave? Uh, let's. Fine. I'll use the R34. Screw you and your rules. I guess it has to be A class. I would assume it has to be A class anyway. Oh man, I missed that freaking thing again because I was checking my phone. I didn't get to read that little tip thing I had going on. Wow. Oh, cool, this You're is a night race. At this level? Um. <laughs> What are you wearing? I just noticed. You were wearing like the dumbest... That was like a green jumpsuit. <laughs> it did not even look like a racing jumpsuit or anything either. Hey, look at that guy in his NSX. Look at that guy. Oh, dude. Totally gonna daunt. What a dick. Hey, man, we're supposed to be Skyline buddies. What are you doing hitting me off the road like that? Fine. Fine, Max. You want it like that? That's how it's gonna be. Oh, God, that cone is like flying through the air. That's pretty cool. All right, finally a night race. It's been a while since I've done one of these. I guess this would be like an evening race, technically. It's not fully nighttime. There's still a little bit of sun in the sky. Oh man, how did they, oh shit. Okay, is that guy got the new WRX? Is that what he's driving? Is that the Evo? I can't tell, they look pretty similar now. A lot of hate's been Thrown. Oh, this is a lap race? Okay. A lot of hate's been thrown at the, uh, what is that? That's a WRX. A lot of hate's been thrown at the uh, new WRX, but I personally like it. Um, I don't know if I like it more than the old design, per se, but I think it looks good. A lot of people are griping because it looks exactly, or not exactly, but really similar to the, uh, the Evo 10, which it does. It does look pretty similar, the body style-wise, but I like the front end of it. I don't think I like it more than the Evo, I still prefer the Evo over it, but it still looks pretty nice, I think. The headlights are pretty cool on it, like, they're pretty wicked looking, pretty sweet looking headlights for sure. And I don't know, it's, it's a it's a good looking car. 
But, of course, anytime you change anything on a, uh, a very popular car, it's going to get a lot of hate. Same thing happened to the Corvette. They completely redesigned the Corvette, and I personally...